I'm Allison Brooks, and this is my life. My favorite thing about Ross is his sense of humor. My best memory from my wedding was probably walking down the aisle and seeing him there. I have nothing but good things to say about Ross. <laughs> I was diagnosed with type 1 diabetes on July the 23rd of 2002. It was the summer between my junior and senior years in high school. I realized my summer had changed and pretty much the rest of my life changed. When I was diagnosed, Ross and I had been dating for less than a year, but he's always been there for me. It's really nice to have somebody that's so supportive in my life, just of me and supportive of my job and my diabetes. Putting some push shots in. Ross and I are competitive. <laughs> <laughs> Whether it be playing video games. You're supposed to hit it over the net. Whether it's running, just whatever. Good game. He keeps me on my toes. <laughs> and he's helped me face a series of challenges in the past year and a half. I'm calling in reference to the job that was posted online. First, I needed to find a job when I graduated from college. I started worrying about getting a job earlier than most of my friends because I wanted to make sure that I had medical insurance. When I first went on interviews, I would have to make sure that I had checked my blood sugar beforehand and that I went in like with the, in the back of my head going, do you say? I have diabetes, or do you not tell them? So I just thought it was important to be forthcoming. After getting a job, I moved in with Ross as we planned our wedding. And then he really got to live with diabetes. The little things like waking up in the middle of the night with a low blood sugar, the uh, testing right when you wake up, um, testing before you go to bed, um, testing before dinner, after dinner. Now, we're facing new challenges together. I'm beginning to run with Allison now to encourage her so she can reach her goal of running a half marathon. Allison and I are going through running the same way we manage her diabetes together. I think she's only gotten better and better. Allison has basically just learned to manage her diabetes through experience. Diabetes isn't who I am, but it definitely is a part of my life. When Ross and I decide to have kids, it's just going to be a little bit different. It's going to have to be very planned. We need to really make sure she has the tightest control possible on her diabetes when we decide to have a kid. And I think that that's probably prompted me into taking better care of myself now. We know that we want to be parents. We know that we want to have a family. And whatever way that that happens, I think that only time will tell. <laughs>